I am Chris Edwards and welcome to this week's Tennis Warehouse vlog. This week we have some new shoes from Artie, some new colors getting ready for the French Open, their Paris collection here. So let's jump straight in. First up, my favorite Adidas shoe to rock on the court is the Barricade. Love the colorway. Here you're gonna look super sick no matter what color surface you're on in this shoe. Quick look at the medial side right there. And then for you clay court mm -hmm. dirt ballers out there, we have a clay court version as well in black. And you'll notice the difference in the outsoles here. So on the black one, got that full herringbone. The uh, tread goes right through the midfoot. So you're not gonna get big chunks of clay stuck in the bottom of the shoe. It's gonna be a nice, smooth, easy transition from heel to toe. And the shoe's gonna stay mm -hmm. lighter and that thinner grooved herringbone really digs into the clay and it gives you plenty of grip out there. The uh, lightweight speed player looking for maximum court coverage here. We've got the Ubersonic 4. Again, great colorway. It's going to tie in with all of the Paris collection apparel we have on the website, so be sure to check that out as well. Love the look of that one. And again, we have a clay court offering as well here. We actually got a couple of them. I just grabbed one here. And again, you'll see that full herringbone tread pattern. It's going to give you dynamite traction out there on the clay courts. Uh, two great shoes, two great colors um, in each, and I uh, can't go wrong with those from Adi. Okay, next up, we've got a new string. I haven't had a chance to hit this one yet. And this is from MSV, and this is called MSV Swift Comfort. So it is a, an extruded monofilament string, but it is designed to be more forgiving. So expect this one to give you some good ball pocketing. And uh, if we get out and hit this one, I'll bring it back on the vlog and give you some of our first impressions on it. Okay, let's jump into some vintage now. First up, We've got one of the Prince Chang rackets. This one's a mid plus, so 95 square inch racket. We've had these on the vlog before. Plastic still on the handle. Um, great collector ball to hang on the wall if you're gonna hit it. Sometimes these grips have deteriorated under the plastic, so uh, be prepared to put a new grip on if you take the plastic off and wanna give it a whirl out there on the court. But dynamite racket to collect and also to get out and hit. And then a similar era graphite racket too is this precision oversize. So this one's a 107 um, graphite. It's got the crossbar stabilizer there too, but with the more modern aero design beam than you get from a POG. Uh, again, super nice racket to get out and hit with. Uh, expect a firmer, crisper feel from that one than a classic graphite. And uh, again, nice collectible right there. Okay, next up, we've got a uh, Prestige uh, Flex Point here, uh, mid plus, so you've got the full caps with the cutout grooves for the flex point grommet holes right there on the uh, three and nine o'clock positions of the hoop. It's a great playing racket. Uh, I remember reviewing this one when it came out and um, did really well with our play testers. Again, nice collectible there. This one does have a slightly larger grip, so four and five eighths on that one. Just be aware of that. And then last, but certainly not least, we've got a pure control team. The classic Babala players racket was the softer, more controlled option for Bubble R players back in the day, and it was popular on tour with numerous players. And um, again, got the head placard in it, so nice collectible there. It was plastic still on the handle, and um, that's a good one to get out and hit as well. Okay, that's all I got for this week. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs>